get Mr. Hat.
Cairo, folks. <laughs> it's your host, Blind Adam, the comic pimp. This is the Awesome Sauce Comics Podcast, and we're back. First, I'd like to apologize for taking a week off after Labor Day. Um, I was at TJ Money's house for a week. I had some appointments. I uh, did Clifton Comic Con on the 13th. I'd like to thank everyone for stopping by the Awesome Sauce Comics uh, booth or table. Um, I'd like to thank John Paul for running such an awesome, amazing, and magical show. Johnny, uh, www.njcomicshows.com for more information. Hasbro Heights is September 27th at the Holiday Inn um, in Hasbro Heights. Uh, you can always call 973-783-0608 for more information. Um, dealer tables are $75. Um, you can always email, um, get in touch with John Paul on Facebook, NJ Comic Shows. And it's the best small con in the country, best conventions in New Jersey. That would be Clifton. And the next Clifton is October 11th. Um, at 1242 Main Avenue in Clifton, New Jersey, which is the rec center. Um, October 25th is the Wayne Show at the Regency Inn. Um, I guess October 25th, um, you know, and of course, JP, thank you. Thank you for all you do. You're welcome to come out anytime you want. I love you, man. And, uh, I'm glad to be back. We will be getting back to our regular schedule. Um, we got a lot going on. I got uh, Fuzz Dog and Nicole's wedding coming up next Friday on September 25th. Um, Friday, we will have Arlen Shearer back for an interview um, this Friday, um, which will be the 18th of uh, September. Uh, we also are going to have Joey Kramer back sometime before New York Comic Con, which takes place at the Javits Center October 8th for the 11th. I am also negotiating for some space with Manhattan Mini Storage. For the best place to store your, store your shit and helping people live small, big lives in small spaces in New York City, www.manhattanministorage.com, the official storage unit facility of the Also Sauce Comics podcast. Uh, I don't have a heck of a lot to say. I just want to say, man, I, I miss doing this. Uh, the reason I opened up with the, that is all the music from the musical issue, 40.1, written by Danny Way. I forget who the artist was. Um, and I found it on YouTube, and I love the, uh, the OCP the OPP um, spoof, as well as the uh, One More Time spoof, and it's just so much fun. Deadpool is going to be the Valentine's Day movie sensation starring Ryan Reynolds, and uh, that Backlund chick who's in everything. And uh, if anyone has any rare Deadpool items they want to sell, need to make the money, 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 then please email comicvip at gmail. I am paying up $300 for 9.8 raw copies of New Mutants 98. I'm also buying any original Ed McGinnis Deadpool art, 201-675-2104. Paying, paying really decent money. And uh, I need to restock all my, Ted, my, all my Deadpool stuff um, before um, November 6th, 7th, and 8th. Um, which will be my next show up at the, up at the Dunkin' Donuts Center the Civic Center up in Providence, Rhode Island for the Rhode Island Comic Con and I'm going to do a huge statement on that tomorrow probably because I do have a conference call at 8 o'clock. I'd like to give a shout out to Jessica. Hey Jess, how you doing? You know, I want to say thank you for, for a year of friendship a year of support. I thank you for being my best friend and uh, I'm going to have you back on the show Maybe th maybe Thursday ish. I crap can't go the, can't do it Thursday. Um, maybe Friday in the afternoon before I have Shimmer on at night. But we're gonna have Jessica back on the show. Um, just talk a bunch of stuff. I love having Jess on. 
everyone should be as blessed as I am to have a best friend like that. Uh, but I am buying the top five books I am paying big money for. And you should be flipping. Deadpool Secret Wars. Secret Secret Wars number two. The Gwenpool cover by Chris Bachelow. Gwenpool is going to become a thing. She's going to have her first full official in canon appearance, which isn't a cover. I thought taking a bubble bath. Um, and How Are the Duck number one. And if you can find Deadpool Secret Secret Wars number two, the, the Gwenpool cover for under 20 bucks, or 20 bucks and below, snag them and sell them for 50. It's going to be a hot book for, for years to come. Um, number two, third, fourth, and fifth Prince of Edge of Spider Verse number two. Spider Gwen is hot. She looks hot. She is hot. The character is hot. And uh, I still see that this character is going to have legs for years to come. And I think the fourth and fifth prints on this book are just going to be smashing hot. Uh, you know, number three, you know, um, Beavis of My Head, number 28. It's the final issue of the show about the classic Beavis of My Head comic book from Marvel. Very, very underprinted, underordered, underappreciated. And it's a book I just like. Uh, number four, Marvel, Marvel Knights, Spider-Man number 20. Ryan Michael Bendis will be using, uh, you know, uh, Mary Jane Watson in his Invincible Iron Man run, starting with issue four. And, uh, she wore the armor for the first time, the Iron Man armor in this, uh, I think Mark Miller was still writing at this point. Oh! <coughs> hmm. The chicken shinner burp. The chicken shinner burp. But, you know, it's now on the rise. And number five, just because I like it, Ren and Stimpy number one, the 17th print. There are 17 printings of this bad boy. Either a first print with, with a, the air fillers is always good, um, or the 17th print. And yes, this is the first professional written work by Dan Slott. Testify. Us. That's that's Eileen Sarkin and some classic bits from the animated series, Batman the animated series. is Harley Quinn. You know, uh, like I said, I'm just screwing around today. Um, just nice to be back doing what I love. And my lesson of the day is, if you can find something you uh, you love, um, you'll never work a day in your life. I love to talk trash, I love to tell dirty jokes, I love the company of beautiful women, I love comic books and movies, play and make believe. And now for Awesome Sauce Comics, and all the improvements we're going to be making here in the Awesome Sauce Comics uh, network, I'm getting to do all that, and I'm just having the time of my life. So, just like I said, you know, you find something you love, you, find, you convince people to give you money for it, and you'll have everything you ever wanted. You always follow your heart, follow your gut, find good people to help you along the way. People who can teach you, train you, mentor you, and help you become the best in the world. You know, uh, and uh, have fun. Because you, you don't get a second chance to live your life. You only can live once. So just make the best of it and go, awesome sauce! Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, um... Just got a little bit of time left. I'd like to give another shout out to uh, the official gentlemen's club of the uh, Awesome Sauce Comics podcast. That would be Scores. As always, rocking Scores hat. Scores is in New York City. ScoresNY.com. Um, for lap dances, great drinks, great food, 
lovely music, beautiful women, you know, uh, bachelor party, divorce party, graduation party, you know, you can even hold a wedding there, I think. I wonder about that. You know, broke, broke college girls, as long as you're from the age of 21 who need to make the money, 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 scoresny.com, 28th, West 28th, between 10th and 11th Avenue in New York City. And it is awesome sauce to the boss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, uh, <clears throat> I take the hat off now. You know, so like I said, for the next two weeks, until after the wedding, I need to a little bit because I have to go back to JKTC on the 29th to, uh, now get, give another lecture at the JKTC, Joseph Cohen Training Center. Um, you know, and then New York Comic Con. So I'm not doing a daily show. I apologize. I want to make the show daily. I want to keep it daily. I want to keep it fresh. I want to keep it hopping, hopping, hipping, hopping, hipping, hopping, hipping, hopping. But sometimes life gets in the way. Sometimes you you stay at a friend's house that has a really shitty internet connection. You know, or sometimes, you know, uh, a friend calls for the crisis and you have to help them out. And you just, unfortunately, money will come and go in life. But the one thing you can never get back is time. And I wish it was more than 24 hours in a day sometimes. But, uh, you know, I'm going to have a very, very special, some thing, special things planned for New York Comic Con. Um, and uh, I'll talk about more of them when I do a full episode. You know, uh, definitely looking forward to uh, the fall TV season. You got, you know, Gotham Season 1 just came out on DVD last week. Uh, ben McKenzie and Lord, Robin Lord Taylor, as well as some other cast members, will be at New York Comic Con October 8th through the 11th. Cannot wait. Uh, I'll, uh... You know, October, September 21st, Gotham Season 2 does come out. Cannot wait to see what they're going to do with certain things. I just saw, they're not going to play it now. I'll play it tomorrow. Uh, a really, really cool scene between uh, Robin Lord Taylor as uh, Cobblepot and uh, Ben McKenzie as uh, Gordon, which looks sweet. Um, if you want to read some, a really, really good story and watch some of the source material it was, you can always get got the first trade of Gotham Central. Gotham Central does the story of the Gotham City Police. Um, you can always grab a copy of uh, Gordon of Gotham, Batman Year One. Uh, and I'm excited to see how they're going to do villains like Clayface and Mr. Freeze and, you know, this female Firefly that they got going. So it's going to be awesome. And then, of course, October 6th. <gasps> I mean, yeah, October 6th is The Flash. October 7th is Arrow, coming back to the CW. Um, still, I'm going to watch all the episodes of Vixen um, after the conference call tonight. And I have to do something for Jess, but uh, I'm going to do a review of those. The first episode looks pretty sweet. Um, once again, everyone has a pen up to 30 bucks, but you want to make an easy $30, email comic pen, VIP at Gmail. 2016752104. I am buying Action Comics 521, the first fixing for that price. Please remember, I do have to make money. So, you know, uh, if you want to get the $50 plus that it goes for on eBay and that shows it in stores, you know, just cut out the middleman. But if you need a quick 30 bucks, you got an extra coffee line around. We are buying. Test of You know, uh, September 29th, 29th is also the Sh Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. does come back. Greg Lee Clark is uh, Phil Coulson. Uh, Daisy Johnson, and she's going to be awesome. Cannot wait uh, to see how they're going to do this whole on Humans thing. And uh, it's just going to be a great, you know, you got um, the, the, the all new, all different Marvel coming out. Uh, Amistadish Cho is going to be the all, the totally awesome Hulk. Um, 
and I think the book to get is probably going to be, because, you know, Amazing Fantasy 15 is, yeah, I was asked shows for a superior, so read a $100 book. I mean, if you can find them for under, for like 60 bucks or under, grab them. But I say the book that's going to climb is Incredible Hercules number 133, which tells the origin of Amadeus Cho. Um, you know, as well as the first... I say maybe in the 120s, maybe? Whatever the first um, issue was where they switched over from Incredible Hulk to Incredible Hercules, I think it's a book on the rise. It's the first uh, issue right after everything got messed up in the, either at the point of the Hulk or World War Hulk. But, you know, there's going to be good stuff. I mean, you got a new Patsy Walker book coming out. Oh, November 20th, Jessica Jones, Kristen Ritter as Jessica Jones, will be on Netflix. That's going to be exciting. Can't wait. Can't, hopefully the cast will be at Comic-Con, because I can't wait to see what the Marvel booth is going to have. And, uh, Things are just going to be awesome sauce. Um, I'm just glad to be back. I'm glad to be back in the studio. I love you all. I thank you for being a loving family. I'm going to have a more planned out episode tomorrow. I just want to touch base. Say thank you for putting up with the little laps in episodes. Um, I'd like to give the final shout out of the night to uh, Sal's Pizza Corner, 71 West Main Street. Ramsey, New Jersey, 07446. They are the home of the nice slice. They give life advice. Say Joey Slap Nuts, 201-327-8929. There's a 50 chance possibility I may be seeing you Friday. <laughs> but this is Brian Adams saying, you know, keep one foot in the gutter, one fist in the cold. Too hot to handle, too cold to hold. Brian Adams out. Oh, awesome song. button. Enter.